All right, guys. Good morning. It's me, Tony Decatur. Welcome to the Reject Run Now podcast. This episode today is What to Watch Wednesday, everybody. Of course, we all know we like to advise people to watch a certain movie, a certain show, a certain, you know, spiel, basically. Uh, today's movie, actually, at top of hand, we're going to keep it in the spirit of October for the month of Halloween. It is... The Wolfman, you guys. The 2010 version of The Wolfman. Now, in my opinion, it got a bad rep from everybody. In my opinion, you guys, when I watched it, it was a really good... It's a really good story. It's a really good film. I mean, overall, it's entertaining. That's the purpose of a movie. It's entertaining. Now, I can't say that if the sole purpose in the beginning was to make it like a horror flick, I don't know... I could say, yeah, it didn't succeed it that way. But it was entertaining to say the least. It was spooky. It was dramatic. It was intense pertaining to the transformation. Um, but, you know, it, I felt like it gave it a really good homage to the original Wolfman back in the ah, 70s or something. I don't even really know. But, I mean, I feel like it gave a good homage. I felt like it was a great overall performance by Benicio Del Toro, everybody. You guys already know him. He's a phenomenal actor. He has a great repertoire. So I don't understand where this got a bad rep. I don't understand it. I mean, she, he was partnered up with Emily Blunt, which, of course, if we all know, they already were on tag team in the movie Sicario, which, again, was phenomenal. So it doesn't make compute to me on why it got a bad rep on that sense but i think it's great i think you should definitely go out and watch it if you can i believe it's on peacock right now if you guys have peacock definitely watch it out or if you own it put it on put it on the tv watch it for today and take a look at it it's great it's a great film great overall um action in general you know at the end basically you know big guy versus the other guy you know what i mean stuff like that um, also, Anthony Hopkins is in that movie, you guys. If you guys know his repertoire, great actor, great, great man in general. So, you know, obviously it's going to be, you know, it's a well-star cast. So it, it's a good input, you guys. It's a great Halloween flick. It's phenomenal. I mean, it's a universal monsters of all you guys. You know what I mean? We wanted to get started when that movie came around, the monster universe. And I think it gave it a good startup to where all of them can kind of come in possibly and, you know, be, uh, maybe like uh, Easter egg each other or something like that, you would say, or come on board and make a make an actual Universal Monster team, which I think was the niche of it because it was going to get started off with this film, then The Mummy, then Dracula. So it was kind of in the role there. You know, Frankenstein, I think, was the next one, but because of everybody not liking The Mummy, things kind of went down south. So... Again, I think this is actually a good startup. I don't really think it needs to be rebooted, which what I've heard, if you guys haven't heard, Ryan Gloss Ryan Goslin. I always say Glasson. <laughs> Ryan Goslin is actually gonna be making Wolfman. Now it's gonna be titled Wolfman instead of The Wolfman. But, you know, date wise, we don't know when it's confirmed it's gonna be coming out, but they're gonna reinstall it and kind of revamp it from the Universal Monster Universe again. Um so it gets coming up. But again, I think there's a lot of key factors in this film uh, that you guys need to look out for. You know, just pay attention to it. It's really good. I think it's awesome. awesome. Definitely best to be watched at night, of course. Lights off, in the couch or on your bed, wherever you are. Put the TV on. Have everything nice and silent. If you have the surround sound, put it up there. That helps out too. And it just gives it a better, you know, feeling to the film. Gets you, gets you like... Uh, how do you say, focused on what's basically on the screen. So definitely watch it out for you guys. So that's my niche for What to Watch Wednesday. I think we got a lot more stuff coming in, of course, for What to Watch Wednesdays pertaining to the Monster Universe. So pay attention, you guys. We're going to get the rest of the team on board and get us uh, their pick of the movie for the month. So love you guys. Thank you guys for listening again. Totally appreciate all the support. Uh, remember to follow us on TheRejectRundown.com. Check us out on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Spotify on YouTube where everything is posted. Oh, also Apple Podcasts too as well. <laughs> well, this is me signing off, Tony the Kid. You guys have a good night.